Okay, so we closed on the house yesterday. So today is the day and we are going to sign the documents for us to purchase the house. And it is honestly nerve wracking. So it's like, it's like you're excited, you're anxious. You know, I decided to pick like the earliest time so that, um, you know, I could kind of get it out the way. So I am like so excited and nervous. So I guess I'll see y'all once I'm done signing everything. And like, so now I am about to do a walkthrough and I think I'm pretty close. And I think, um, yeah, so we purchased this fixer wrapper. It was a pretty good price. And the plan is to fix it up, live in it for a while and possibly rent it out in the future. And then we purchase a move in ready home and yeah so what i'm gonna do is i am going to walk out through my new home and i plan on taking y'all through the journey of us actually fixing it up so yes my channel is changing again but i feel like this is pretty cool this is a journey this is a process and i feel like what happens is a lot of people don't know the journey a lot of people don't know the process and they jump into it not knowing and thinking it's going to be easy and cheap because so many people are doing it and it is not easy nor cheap um so my arm is getting tired um so yeah that is the plan so let's go through my house oh yeah before i go there are some things i brought over and yeah, so you'll see that but everything else is empty so there's some things in the living room but everything else is empty and i'm probably also going to walk through my vision for certain things at the home so let's get to it all right so this is um the front there we go and all of this is going to get um refaced pressure washed and all that so it's i'm doing that probably in the springtime and yes my house is like a pinkish type color and my door is green and my guys my shutters are burgundy yes so this is going to be a whole um a different color and i need to replace um the mailbox that is irritating the mess out of me so let's go ahead on in how about that see i need to i plan to repaint the concrete here there's no cracks in it, so that is a good thing. So I don't have to worry about um, the cracks in any concrete. And this is the mailbox. Tell me this is not an ugly mailbox. This mailbox is so ugly. All right, so yes, let's go. All right. So when you first come in, right, you come into my living room. Um, so this is the living room. It has no lights. So we have to um, get some lights put in and that has to get done before we actually move in in about three or four weeks um because my son already tried to take down this lamp and then when you first also come in i'm gonna open up this door it'll be all right there is a closet here and i plan to take this door off so that when you walk in there's like no real big blockage because when you first walk in and you see you walk into like a door so that is bugging me all right so when you walk this way you're going to my kitchen yes my kitchen is a sight for sore eyes and i have to plan to do a whole kitchen renovation so make sure you subscribe to the channel to to see the kitchen renovation and i plan to do the kitchen renovation in sections so it will be different videos to the whole renovation so um i plan to keep this cabinet but not this appliance here not that appliance not that appliance and really not this y'all it's on wheels it is on wheels okay that's out is it and we have to replace all of these i I would have liked to keep them and then just um, hook them up, but the inside is so damaged, it needs to get fully replaced. Those are going, because that don't even make any sense. Like there's empty space. Who likes empty space, right? And I might replace those. Those are pretty good, but I might 
have to replace them to match whatever we get down there. I don't like this up here because I feel like it's blocking, you know, more brightness into the room. So I want this kitchen to be light and airy, really bright um, and things like that. And the fridge is going. So if you continue through, shoot, you get this room and holy moly, right? So the plan for here is just to redo the ceiling, um, get someone to come out, redo the ceiling, fix all of that. So I might have to replace that whole wall, possibly replace this wall and possibly replace that wall. So there's a lot of things in here to replace. So I like that also to be done before we move in. So also we do have a screened in porch and I am going to paint the concrete in there as well as in the utility room. And this door has this room right here has two doors so let's go in from this way sorry and this is my office so yeah this is my office and i actually plan to use this closet for my clothes because the master bedroom closet is about this size and me and my husband things would not fit in both so yeah and then this is the basic um linen closet and i plan to hook up this linen closet really nicely but i like that it's white um and the wood is pretty good in here so i might not hook it up too much i might just actually leave it and just put some really nice baskets and things like that in here okay and then this is bedroom number one Okay, so it's a pretty all right size bedroom. This is gonna be my girl, the girl's room and their bed is gonna go over there. TV over here. And I don't know what's gonna go over here yet. <laughs> or I might put the TV over here. Yeah, so TV and dresser here, bed right here. And I might put a desk, like a small desk or something right here. Okay, so now I walked across the hall to the bathroom and this bathroom is super weird, right? So it's not that bad though. Sink, okay? And then you have your toilet and then over here is a shower. But the thing with the shower is, first off, this is like right here, right? And it's like a square. Yeah, so it's a little weird. Um, so probably next year, we'll probably take all of this out and do a nice stand-up shower in here. So that is the plan for that. And then this is the other bedroom, okay? So this one's pretty big for the boys. So yeah, so I like this one, it's pretty, pretty nice. And the house came with these curtains, so yeah. So let's continue. And then this is the master. And yes, it came with the curtains, okay? So like I was telling you, like this closet isn't that big. See, it like stopped right here, so yeah. So yeah, this is the master. I'll probably put my bed here dresser probably here and i don't want to keep um too much stuff in here that's the thing and then this is the bathroom okay so it's pretty okay and yes it came with these okay i didn't purchase them <laughs> so yes um that's something else that we need to fix um just a couple things in there so yeah, and this hallway is like freaking long. So yeah, it's four bedrooms in here. And I thought that was pretty good for the price. Um, it just needs some work. And yeah, I found a deep freezer. So I'm happy about that. Nowhere had them in town since quarantine hit. So I'm pretty happy about that. And I like to buy new toilet seats whenever I move somewhere. So I bought two new toilet seats. And I bought some outside lights. And I went to Habitat for Humanity Got a bed and a hutch I would probably be um, painting soon. And I have to replace the lights. There's just so much stuff in here I need to replace and I'm like over it already. But yes, okay, that 
was the walkthrough of my home. And also I have a she shed um, over there. So over there is my she shed. And then over here is my work shed. So it'll have the tools and things like that in that shed over there. Yep, so I am pretty happy with my purchase um, because I have a vision for it. And I know it's gonna take some time as well as money, but I feel like the biggest thing is this kitchen. I feel like if we get the kitchen done within 30 days, we're good. I wanted to get it done before Thanksgiving and Thanksgiving is a couple weeks. So I would like for that to happen. And I feel like it can, um, as long as we get the person out here to get it done. And um, we already got appliances for tomorrow. I mean, yesterday we got appliances and it should be here in a couple weeks. So I'm pretty happy about that. And yeah, so, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Um, this is my first purchase, my first home purchase, and uh, I'm excited. So yeah, thank you for following me along in this journey. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to subscribe because you will follow me along on this journey and it's so exciting. Like, yeah, I'm just ready to jump in and start pulling things out and get into it. So. What I'm going to do today is clean up and all that good stuff. And yeah, so don't forget to subscribe and I'll catch you next time. Bye.